they cannot escape me. You wanna watch some goofy nigga on the internet, richer than them with breast teeth. I'm gonna go try, I'm gonna fuck it up. Get them records, I pop my boss. Say you want me, then you out of love, baby girl, you out of love. That's all she never gonna club. Say you want me to the club. Hey man, what's up, YouTube? Back with another video, man. Um, I'm gonna be telling y'all everything y'all need to know about NBA 2K22 before y'all buy it, just what to expect, etc. But if y'all new here, please subscribe to your boy. I'm gonna pull up on your dad, man. I post every single day, bro. So if y'all want content every single day, more NBA 2K22 content, go ahead and subscribe to your boy. Alright, first thing first, I got on the list is what to expect. Now, what I think you guys should expect before you buy NBA 2K22, like, what y'all should expect, it should be better than 21. 21 is, like, one of the worst 2Ks. They can't go downhill from here. So, if you play 2K21 a lot, I recommend you should buy 2K22 just because it will be better and it will be a step up and an improvement from 21. I bet. Um, Next thing you should expect, if you're on next gen, like, feel me, like, you will have a whole different... Like, uh, city, that's what it's called, yeah. City, um, it wouldn't be a whole different, but it's different. It won't be the same as you know it in the last 2K. And if you're on current gen, the neighborhood won't be, it'll be a completely different neighborhood. Um, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like a boat or a cruise ship or something like that. And it, like, changes around the, the I guess you'd probably say the, the map, uh, throughout the 2K. That's one thing y'all should expect is different parks. Next thing is like my career based so 2k 22 for current gen it will have obviously a different story mode but it won't be like that interesting it'd be like basically as interesting as 21 but if you're on next gen the my career is going to be completely different you're gonna have like different pathways to the nba and it's just way better like my career wise on next gen um which i would like it makes sense for them to give them a better my career and whatnot and also on next gen you'll be able to do You'll, ever, you'll be able to be like a rapper and a fashion designer and stuff on the side. But this is probably the last thing I'm going to tell y'all that y'all should expect. But you should expect the gameplay to feel a little bit different. Um, like they removed the speed boost, glitch left and right that all the little kids did. Um, on next gen, there's like going to be more things with the post up. So you can like make more moves with the post up. Like how Jason Tatum. And, you know what I'm saying? Like you just do post up like combinations if that makes sense. And then yeah, so they removed... A lot of that stuff and they also they said that it's gonna be harder to score and defense is gonna be more skill based so the game is probably gonna feel a little bit different not gonna feel like completely a whole new game but it's gonna feel like like just different all right so the advice i'd give you is don't pre-order i ain't gonna lie i pre-ordered it just because i'm gonna play it regardless but if you are thinking of buying another game, like if you're deciding between like, let's say Madden 22 or NBA 2K22, wait till you see NBA 2K22 gameplay and wait till you see what people are saying about it, like the reviews and whatnot, before you buy it. Um, I mean, you always can get a refund, but you should always wait to buy it. Don't pre-order it. Um, also, advice, if you're a content creator and you're gonna buy 2K22, um, I would recommend buying it, like pre-ordering it, um, just cause it's an investment. It's an investment, so people will watch you before they buy it. So, but if you do buy it and you pre-order it, you gotta go crazy. You gotta go crazy. That's my that's my plan too. But for sure, if you plan on doing content creation in 2K22, then you probably should definitely pre-order the game every time it come out. But this is the last thing before I end this video. You feel me? Um, just think, have fun with the game. You feel me? If you don't think you'll have fun playing it, don't buy it. Cause I feel like. With 2K21, like people bought it at the beginning, and then with next gen at least, they bought it and never played it again just because it wasn't fun. So if you're just a casual and you play this game, bro, watch gameplay. And if it's not fun for the other people, it probably won't be fun for you. So don't buy it. But that's it for today's video. I hope y'all young boys enjoyed. I post every single day. Make sure y'all subscribe. And y'all, peace. From over the way they be acting And she said that she like on my eyelids This life I gotta appreciate Remember the time I ain't had this But when they see me in a mansion Tell me that they probably